Getting ready. This is a non-title bout. Instructions being given. Two out of three. Martell. Yeah, I told you we had a barn burger coming. And he's not too anxious. Pulled up, he pulls the mask up and down. You understand it. The mask in itself is not anything that he is that concerned with. It's the fact that it was the only way he could get in the ring uh, with a wig that he could manage to keep on his head. So it is sewn into uh, into that wig. Martell. And go behind by Rose. And as so often happens, oh, flip over the top. A roll up, one, two, no, almost. It so often happens, this is not one of our biggest crowds of the year, even the season. It is a good one, but it is one of the noisiest. I think so often that's because they really died in the wall. Wrestling fans comes out, the signs come out, the yelling goes on. Wild things happen. Martell side headlock grinding down on it. First fall action. If you've been a little late in joining us, main event just underway. No falls yet. Couple of moves and a third one by Rose, and you got to give him credit. He made the good move. on Martell with it. You hear the cry of the crowd. Caught in a figure four leg lock. Buddy Rose bringing it up on top. Forearm smash. Small of the back as Martell tries to rise up against it.
Sensational. Young man from France making a real name for himself. Could have gone on already. He's had some offers, but he is making money, having success, and things to do here in the Northwest. One of them is to get that mask and that's the wig off of Rose and for the first time since he originally had his hair cut, show the bald bunny Rose. on it. We usually bring you the schedule of upcoming cards after this first ball. Don't know if we'll have the opportunity to do that or not, but try to get it to you later in the show. Rose laying back, trying to get a little extra leverage. Almost got hit with a three count. They get caught with two. Got it in a figure four scissors leg lock. Buddy Rose with the hold on Rick Martell. And good shot of it. You see Rose not only having the hold, but he gets the rest. That is uh, rest compared to what Rick is uh, relative resting compared to what Rick is suffering. Tied up in a figure four scissors leg lock. like Martell is tied up Rose's right leg. Now Rose trying to turn it back over and does. He's up with it. Trying to get it reapplied and does. Rose again lying back. Trying to rest, get a little added leverage. Both. First ball action. Just underway. Rose looking into the camera right at you folks at home and saying, I got the smarts. It's the brains that does it for me. The whole that figure four leg lock. Martell now loses himself from it. Uh, that's been circulation's been cut off in that leg. Rose is up and at him. And the cripplers are back at work. Savage. Busted ankle. Don Leo Jonathan. Ribs caved in. Piper. Bruce back. He'll be he'll return next Saturday here to Portland Sports Arena. 
left leg now. Inside Toho. Rolled over, cradle one, two, and Rose almost bought it. Martell, really, limping around, unable to put any weight in that leg. Rose, flying seat drop to the inside of the knee. And up on a hamstring. Martell got a headlock trying to pull him off the hold. Martell still caught. In the tow hold. Again, going and getting out of the way, Martell. Gets the leg out of the way. Sit out, backbreaker. Martell, and he went to it on his left leg that has taken all that punishment. So I think he got hurt worse than Rose did. He gave a sit out, backbreaker to Rose. But it was right on top of that knee that's been hurting. Watch out, Rose outside the ring over near that ring post. He's going to wrap the leg around it. And again, the left leg of Martell. Last week, a punishment given to Piper and uh, early in a match, a team match, and he couldn't come out. Now they are working on that leg again. I, they, I think, just automatically think of the Army. Martell caught, and he's going to have to give it up. His left leg, Rose, finally drops it. Rose, winner of the first fall. Playboy Buddy Rose. In 12 minutes, we'll be right back. 29 seconds. We're going to take a timeout as we listen to answer the bell. Chris Martell says the match will continue, and he's on his way out right now. Well, there's that answer. Martell is being helped by security people down to ringside. He is limping badly on that left leg. And Rose holding the ropes apart for him. Martell is not going to, about to trust him. Martell is going to try to continue. I've also just been notified that uh, if this match goes short, we have a standby bout for you. So let's see what happens. But Martell has had a full rest period now. He's coming back. Hardly able to move. Mobility pretty well gone. And that's what Rose is going after, that left leg. Well, the Cripplers have returned with a vengeance. It's been a while since they put anybody out. 
uh, business. It had been a while. But they're busy at it now. And by they, I keep referring to the Army. It's gotten to be when you see the sheep herders, you think of Rose. And you see Rose, you think of the sheep herders. In a corner, Rose. Ah, yeah, now Rose wants to sucker him into the middle of the ring if he can. He's on the corner. He can kind of lean on the ropes. And Martell is, well, circling as best he, he can. And he's caught in it. Caught in a scissors. The left leg in a scissors hold. Working on the left leg, Sandy Barr checking to see if it's legal. It is, he's grinding. Apparently, or if he's doing something illegal, he's not being caught. Martell, left leg, caught by Buddy Rose. Turning him over into a half crab, but Martell is under the ropes. And he turned him over. Now he pulls him back and is going to pull back. Oh, he drives the knee. And it is the knee. Ligaments, cartilage, might even be a cracked patella, the kneecap. Now working on the hamstring. He's trying to ruin that leg from the knee up to the hip. Playboy Buddy Rose, pull back. Now going outside the ring with it. That left leg already. I would almost be sure there's a very good chance of ligaments being torn in. Rose! Grabbed by Martell in his head. Slammed into the ring post. Now Martell back in. If Rose looks to be out to me, a count of 20, he could win a second fall. But can he come back for the third even if he does? Now Martell's going out after him. Martell apparently did not care about winning it or losing it. He wants to punish him. He runs him. Small at a back flat into the ring post or maybe and there's a good chance of this he's a lot smarter than me and decided to punish him a little bit more making it that more difficult for him to get back in the ring I believe he is just out to get him now while he can he is outside stopping on Rose Rose the small of the back run into that seal ring post working on Rose outside the ring. And again, into the ring post. Martell, Gimpy on that left leg. I got a kind of Six, seven, eight, and you know this, the count stops every time Martell goes on after him. Now the count is on both of them. Martell out after Rose, and now it's a reverse situation. It is Martell trying to do the hurting. And he wants him back in the ring. Martell moving better on that left leg. Well, dealing out the punishments can sometimes make yours feel a lot better. Martell with knee drops, small in the back. He twisted that leg again. That left leg still is not 100% by any means. Buddy Rose, the playboy. 
The crowd counting out the double club blows. He can't. Buddy, uh, Buddy Rose in nearly in a position of not being able to defend himself. Sandy Barr checked him and let it go. And the Boston Crab, if Martell can turn him over to it, he's got him putting on the pressure. And he's got it awfully well applied. And Rose has to give it up. It's all even. We're all even. Ball a piece. Martell does not want to drop the hole. Finally, on the count, does. And five minutes and 50 Listen to this seconds. chair. Well, the winner of that fall heading for the dressing room. We think all our sponsors the ring just now getting into it. Buddy Rose. They are center stage at the Portland Sports Arena. Well, whip hard into the corner. Stay with us now. We are going to keep it right here. Brakes are out of the way. Backbreaker, yes, and he did it with his right leg this time. One, two, and a flail kick. Foot stop, small to the back. It's that back. Martell wants to work on a shot to the midsection by Rose. Now he's lifted. Suplex drop on that back. Martell with a vengeance to say the least. Turns him over. Knee drop coming up. Yes. But be a little careful, Rick. You drove it with that left one and gets it again. Left one apparently feeling better at the heat of action. Got him in a chin lock from behind, pulling back on it. Forearm smash. Fingers got the eyes. Rose brings Martell out, going for Eight body slam, and he couldn't do it. Rose could not take the pressure of the weight. Holding Martell up above him, the back gave out. He had to just let him down on his feet. Rose unable to drive him. Uh-oh, this could do it. A great line. The abdominal stretch puts a lot of pressure on that back. Rose grabs the hair of Martell, pulls him over. Martell has him in trouble. Whip into the corner, shoulder throw out of the corner. Seven minutes remaining. Going after the mask. Martell now going after the mask. That would be the supreme insult. Rose, who has said that people will not see me bald. I will wear wigs until my hair goes back to its original loveliness. Martell has it about halfway off to get that mask off. Up over toward the floor. Of course, it'll slip off from there. Rose now holding on to it. Martell gets it off. Martell gets it off, but the sheep herders are there. Rose heading for the dressing room. Well, I hope you didn't turn your head. Rose has run to the dressing room. The sheep herders. 
The sheep herders got there. The count's going on. I do not think Rose is going to come back in the ring. He is all the way back to the dressing room. Sheep herders came out, saying he was in trouble. Rick Martell wins it as the mask and the wig. And four minutes and 17 seconds. Martell wins the match. Sandy Barr. Rose did not return no, to the ring. Rick Martell. Uh, I think, I don't know what Sandy's explaining. We might have to get him up here. I think he is saying that he'll have to return the mask and the hair. That's it. He was explaining it. it's a part of the man's equipment, illegal equipment, worn in the ring. Martell wants to keep it. Martell wins the match. He wanted to keep the mask and the wig, but Sandy Barr would not allow him to. I believe that that is uh, the ruling on it. We'll have to wait and see for sure. But that. Uh, Quite sure that that's what it is. He's taking it back to the dressing room. Okay, we're going to keep it here. We're going to fill out the time, and uh, I don't know if they're going to. Throw